Welcome back to US Triple Tap. This is a review of the Bug Pocket, also known as the Backup Gun Pocket. That's available to law enforcement and military. Uh, the, the primary market for this product would be local, state, and municipal law enforcement agencies that uh, their officers wear uniforms. And you have a ballistic vest that's underneath the uniform as opposed to an outer carrier. Um, whenever you go through training, you're taught to protect your weapon. If you get into a fight and somebody's grabbing at your weapon, your hand is full here, and you're, if you have a backup gun and an ankle holster, you got to bend over and try to get to it. And if you only have your secondary hand available, it may be on the wrong side. If you have a pocket holster, it may not be easy to get to, once again, if you're in a fight. Um, this one's product actually solves all those situations. Um, backup gun pocket is is attached to your um, ballistic vest, okay, underneath your uniform. So if somebody actually was trying to get at my gun or if I just need my backup gun, it's as close as here, pull down the panel, and then there's your backup gun right there. What's nice about this is you can turn the gun in either direction. So Whichever, whichever way you want to go, you can make it left or righty. It, the the uh, pocket itself doesn't care which way you turn it. The uh, panel here is a Kevlar panel, so this makes it unique to other holsters that attach underneath uniforms to your vest. This one here has a cover on it that's actually Kevlar, so if you took a round in the panel, it's not going to hit the gun and shatter the gun, and you got fragments that could potentially go up under your arms into an artery or up in your neck. Um, this solves that issue there also. And it also makes it easier, it's like a door to just open and get at the gun with either hand that you need. If I need it righty or lefty, I can get at it that way. Okay, this is another view of the uh, backup gun pocket on the uh, ballistic carrier. Uh, right now the panel's still inside. Uh, one of the things that you sort of have to adjust a little bit is the weight of the gun will eventually pull down the front part of the uh, carrier so um, you know if, if you're anal you might readjust it every once in a while I don't really care as long as it's still working the way it's supposed to work um, Velcro holds the door on um, like I showed you before with the shirt on this just pulls open and then there's your backup gun All right, um, this here is your Kevlar panel and it removes as you see um, if you have a, um, a trauma plate inside, uh, they recommend, like this is a hard trauma plate, um, they recommend that you don't wear a hard trauma plate because uh, one of the ways it makes it more concealable, and right now it's all wrinkled out because I just pulled that ballistic panel out, um, the, one of the ways it makes it more concealable is the gun will eventually uh, form your ballistic panel, uh, your main ballistic panel, and concave it a little bit and that will make it less uh, of a profile sticking out. Now the ballistic panel that I did have in there, now you can see all these wrinkles and all, actually keeps this door relatively smooth and rounded. So when you have a uniform on, or um, a polo shirt or whatever you're working in, um, it's not gonna be visible. There won't be a profile of the handgun visible because that Kevlar panel will be on top of the gun itself. Um, that's what the bug pocket looks like if you act, have them ship it to you and you have it sewn in. This is a smaller version of it. Uh, they do have it in different colors to match your uh, carrier and your uniform. Um, it comes with the Kevlar panel. And um, for more information, um, check out their website. I highly recommend this product if you're in a, a career that needs a backup gun because it's better to have it than not carry it and this makes it really accessible and not visible to uh, the general shithead that you have to deal with. Once again, thanks again for visiting US Triple Tap and I'll see you guys downrange.